Mass surveillance is the practice of spying of an entire or significant part of the population. It can involve anything from CCTV monitoring and email interceptions to wiretapping and computer hacking. Even though we live in like quite a, not rural, but like quite a small town, there's like security cameras all over the place and some of them might be fake like dummy ones, but you never know if someone is watching you. So you just like feel kind of vulnerable, not vulnerable, but um, you just feel quite intimidated when you walk around everywhere. Like especially in London and bigger cities, when you walk around, there's like CCTV cameras on like every lamppost. It just makes you feel a bit uneasy instead of safer. Do you think mass surveillance is positive or negative? I think it's positive because it can prevent quite a lot of stuff, like with the Ariana Grande stuff when her show got bombed. They knew who it was and like saw him go in with like I don't know if it was a bag or what, purely for the fact there was a load of CCTV in the place where it was in Manchester. But then also like places that need it most, I think are more like train stations and airports. And even though it is there, I feel like sometimes they could just do a bit more and like they could put cameras in the places where it actually matters instead of just putting them in like every place they could think of. Because then when you put them everywhere. Like people then try and look for like blind spots if they're going to try and do something illegal. So like it's just placement of the cameras is what you got to think about if you are going to put them up instead of just like let's just bang on there and there and there. Um, and if you know um, who is Edward Snowden and what did he do? Um, Edward Snowden, I believe, worked for the CIA and then he moved like government firm or something. He worked overseas and did a lot of undercover work, but. He also leaked all the information when he moved jobs. That I don't know if it was all the CIA stuff, but he um, leaked quite a lot of stuff and then put it all on WikiLeaks for everyone to read. And at the moment he's on the run in like Russia or somewhere, and the CIA just wanted to arrest him because he basically told the world what was happening and what they were doing.